it's the fifth episode, and we have a lot to do. So, let's get cracking. But first things first, I actually wanted to try out this resource pack. Um, so, that's what we're going to do now. This faithful 64x resource pack, so I'm interested to see how that's going to look. Oh, and I've actually got it on already. Wow, okay. Yeah. A lot has changed. Oh, yeah, the armor. Literally everything looks, like, smooth. Which is nice. Axe looks cool. Whoa, the leaves are, like, so realistic. Okay, that's cool. I like that. You guys already know what time it is. It's time to pull up that common question of the day. Oh, and we, we actually have two, so... I might as well just uh, answer them both in this episode. Uh, take the book. Right click on the book. Alright, the first one is... Wait, let me pull it up. Where is it? Alright, we got it. We got it. It is from... Paul... Oh, whoops. I've got caps lock on for some reason. Paul... Lennon with three L's. Okay, bro, that is a interesting name. Um, and he says, uh, "Wait, I should probably put a thing here." Yeah, he says, "When are you planning on making some farms?" And I'm actually going to do that this episode, alright? This episode, we're going to be doing that. I'm sure he means, like, automatic farms. And I was planning on doing one this episode. Um, but I don't know if I'm actually going to do it. But I'll try my best. So we got two questions, and we're actually going to put on the second one below this. And it's from... Gamer up. Um, and he is asking, did that skeleton drop that power one bow and? If we just uh, hit up a replay right here on the video, oh, okay, it looks like I actually can't pull up a replay because uh, OBS is being a bit of a scum, but it's okay. But remember, guys, I read all the comments, so if you have a genuine question about like the world, then I shall answer it easy peasy, as you can see right here. Um, and. Here's a free slot for episode 6, if anyone's curious. So just hit me up, and we're gonna plunk her right here. Boom. And as you can see, we just go over here. Boom! We got the, the questions right there. I've answered it. Um, and this, uh, this, this, this question right here, Gamer Up. Did that skeleton drop that power one bow? It actually did. Because I replayed the recording. And that's the reason why Jan died over there was because that skeleton had that power one bow in, in its hand. And the second Jan died, it picked up that sword and just dealt hearts and hearts of damage. So I'm pretty sure that will never happen again though. Um, probably a really stanky bug in the game where skele skeletons can just do that. Pretty unfair, but you know, it's it's Minecraft. Oh, and if you guys watch till the end of the episode, you'll see I've got a special secret for everyone watching. Ooh. But as I said in the beginning of the episode, we have a lot to do. Uh, so I'd rather get some work done with what we have to do. And you, <laughs> you'll see what I'm going to do now.
So we got the beautiful cooking station going here. We got the food and the iron cooking, quick tea cooking. But we need like how much? One animal, like 32 or something. Oh my, look at the textures of this food. Bro, this texture pack is crazy. No, don't do that. Oh, I just wasted like seven minutes of cooking. Well, yeah, let's just have a, a, a view of, of the texture pack on right here. I look like a, a medieval soldier that just came out of war with enchanted armor. Alright, so we need like four, three blocks of iron, and then boom, anvil. And then, hold up, I'm still cooking. Still cooking. Some paper. And we name each paper, like, a shop. So people can choose what shop they want to do. Then I'll give people a chance, like, I'm gonna put a lot of options, like, there's gonna be 20 different papers, 20 different shops. So, you can't say you don't have an option. Alright, I'm, I'm buying this because there's like, one, two, there's not a lot of villages left, so. Oh, what is this? Nothing. Nothing. Don't even choose Don't even Don't even try. Honestly. Alright, so this is gonna be the shopping district because the, the pillar's right there. The village is right here, so might as well make it right here. And my plan for it is gonna be a smoker. Boom, right here. With a chest on top of that. Put some crafting around it. Um Actually, you know what? This is just gonna be like the the choice of what shop you're gonna do. And I just messed it up so that I actually don't know what I'm doing, so don't judge. Something like that, I don't know. And there's gonna be the first one, which is fuel slash coal. And then the anvil's gonna go boom, right there. And there's gonna be a sign pulled up. Let me make that. Alright, we have a child screaming at the top of their lungs. So I'm glad I cut that out. Uh, but we're gonna continue. And there's gonna be a. There's gonna be a lot of options, but for now we can do the most important ones, like iron pond. Be sure I'm the one from the second making iron pond. But we got three options right here. Fuel slash coal, wood shop, iron farm. I don't know if I should do more or if I don't know, I'll do more, whatever. Alright, I just had a chat with Mr. Yun there, and he's gonna hop on soon, which is good news. Uh, it's currently only me on the server, which is which is fine. Uh, some people are busy with life, you know, I can't blame them. I, was, I actually took a break from the from the games for two days, so what can I say? Uh, but we got all the papers, fuel slash coal, wood shop, paper shop, iron farm, iron... Wait. Iron shop? Yeah, we should do iron shop instead of farm. There you go. If people understand what I'm trying to say, there you go. Potion shop, which is the most interesting one, the potion shop, because that's going to be probably the most expensive out of all of this. Uh, and maybe we should also... I actually don't know what I'm going to do. Maybe I should do like a... I did wood shop the last time, so maybe I should do that again. Uh, or maybe fuel. Coal is really scarce, so I don't know. <laughs> I guess maybe you guys can choose for me what, what I should do. Or I'll just choose for myself, eventually. Alright, I really don't know what I'm doing. I just made a platform. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, free food, let's go. No inventory space, let's go. Alright, so we're done with the platform. It's looking good. It's looking clean. Mr. Villager over here, he is chilling. He's got his job opportunity. And he's selling rabbit stew for one emerald, which is a bargain I'll take any day. Alright. We've slept. It's now daytime. And this is the progress of the shopping district. We've got all the papers, fuel. Coal, wood, paper, iron, potion, food, rare block shop, which is like obsidian, glass, and all those like obscure blocks that people just just don't want to get. So, and there's a tool shop, an armor shop, and there's one more thing that I have in mind, which is the gold shop. Who likes grinding gold? Let's be honest. And there's a few more slots here that I can fill in, but I don't really want to because, I mean. Each person, I feel like they, they can have two shops, but like, that's gonna be a lot to maintain. Like, you're gonna have to keep up with the community, really, so. <laughs> I'm gonna go for one shop, because it's easier that way. And maybe two, if I really feel like grinding, but I don't know. Okay, this is a bit of a weird one, but the light saw shop. I don't know, it just came to my mind. Because, you know, there's, there's like a billion different types of light sources. And no one wants to go and grind them, like glowstone or shroom light. No one likes to do that stuff, so it'll be a shop. And you know what? Maybe I should add like a <laughs> an ominous bottle shop. Hell no. 
Alright, this is the last one. The ammo shop, yo. Cause I don't know, I got I ran out of ideas, so like you know, there you go. Alright, there's an enemy in there. I can open my mic up, there we go. And we need this so badly actually. No bro, where did he go? Okay, he's right here. Gotta get him. Oh bro! He just keeps on teleporting somewhere. Alright, there he is. Don't teleport, please, Mr. Man. I need your source. Please don't teleport. Bro, oh my goodness. I'm gonna be running around like a, a hooligan looking for this guy. If he just continues to do this. Oh wow, look at the shopping district all the way from here. That's beautiful. Beautiful to see. Alright, there he is. He just ran down there. I don't know if he's holding. Or if I looked him. I'm here! Yeah, there you go. That's how you get yourself a free end roll. Oh, and by the way guys, this is what shaders I found the other day. But it's, it's a bit, uh, what can I say, it's a bit, it's a bit meh, it's a bit wonky, a bit laggy, you know. And this this is probably the best shaders I can run on this laptop. It gives me like a decent 40 FPS while recording, which is really mad for what it is, like shader wise. Like you'll see now. Like, like, look at this. It's it's playable, and you can see it's like smooth. Oh my gosh! What? Look at this. This is what I could be playing right now. But I I rather stick to vanilla than to switch over to shaders because I don't know. It just looks. It's more appealing to the eye, to the viewers, like eye, to see normal uh, normal like, Minecraft textures than shaders. At least me personally speaking. I don't know. Let me let me know if you guys want to see me play this beautiful shader. And I have to repair this for experience. Nice. Let's go. This iron pickaxe. That's what I'm breaking through. We're actually gonna name it. It's gonna cost us more, but you'll see in a second what I need to use this for. All right, we're gonna name her Vermithal. Yep. And we're gonna put the rest of the iron away. Cool. And the diamond pick. What? We would never miss that. All right. We're back at base, and the crops have been growing beautifully. And I actually think I need to harvest her up. Harvest her upper with her texture packer. All right. If that thing pops up on my screen all the time, I'm just gonna. Fully delete it, I don't care. Um, last episode, we actually forgot to get the most important, like, thing, other than blaze rods, which is nether wart. And there was none in the fortress, so that means I'm gonna have to run, like, a billion blocks to find this. It's gonna take me years to find it. Promise you, if we didn't find it then, it took us like two hours to get there and back, and get the blaze rods. Then I, swear, it's it's gonna take me years. So, I guess this can be like a, a small montage of of me trying to find Netherworld question mark.
Alright, we made it back. We made it back with a lot of goods, actually. Well, hello there. Huh. Man wants to pay a visit to my place, or go ahead. I mean, this is what we came out of the nether with. Um, enough ancient, like, debris or scrap for an ingot, which is crazy. I did not expect to get that, like, in two chests. And a smithing template, which is crazy. And, like, four stacks of quartz, which is what we need. So, I'm actually... Oh, this, I'm glad we didn't get any nether wood, because <laughs> if we did, then we wouldn't have gotten this stuff, so... I swear that sheep has been up there since, like, episode one. And it's still up there. It's it's telling me something, I know it is. Whoa, sheep farm? Alright, we actually gonna set up a portal. Like, um, at the shopping district. Because... I don't want to walk there the whole time. It's, it's kind of a pain in the ass to get there. Alright, so we're at the shopping district. And we're about to put this bad- oh no. Right! We're gonna ignore that we just did that. And we're gonna pretend like we, we didn't just do that. Because that was very cringe. Alright, it totally didn't take us like an hour to find Flint. Let's just pretend it didn't. Yay, now we have a portal at the shopping district, which is awesome. We actually need to sleep before we go. Hey, yo, look at all these achievements, bro. Yeah, let's, let's just have a, a moment to see how good I am at the game. Alright, so first, check on how this net is looking. I've got a fire resistance potion, just in case. It's, like, the worst spawn I've ever seen in my life. And it's the worst spawn I've ever seen in my life. Wow, that could have been so bad. Oh my. That could have been so bad. Alright, at least the, my portal's right over there, which is which is cool. That could have been so bad. No joke. Promise you, if I... If I left that ghast for like a few more seconds, that could have been so bad. As I was saying, this is going to be the potion area. And then this is going to be the map hall. And then I'm gonna have like a. How can I say? Um. A villager on each floor that re re represents like. You know, it's. It's like. Thing. This is gonna be a librarian right here because it's a re receptionist area. And this is his little. Like. Spot. Like his job center spot. And then we actually. We can unblock this now. Uh, this is going to be his storage, and I'm probably going to put a barrel, like, over here, uh, for his storage as well, or just something, I don't know, I don't know why this is here, I'll place that back, because I don't know why I put that back, and the carrots are growing really fast, actually faster than it should be growing, it feels like the tick speed is actually, like, up by a bit. Which is kind of crazy to say, but yeah. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this episode, thank you so much for watching. And this is going to be the end of it, sadly. I hope you guys enjoyed this, like, texture pack. I really think it's cool. Cause, like, it makes it, like, I don't know, that you can see more. Like, look at those leaves, bro. Those leaves are, like, prime. Literally. And my armor looks prime. My shield looks prime. I don't know, everything just looks more crystal clear. You feel me? And that sheep is still there. On top of that hill. He's been there since episode 1. And he's still there. So, maybe I'll put him into like a sheep farm or something. I don't know. Let me know. But thank you guys so much for watching. This was episode 5. And next episode, it's going to be a big, big one. Let's just say that. Um, I'm, I'm sorry I didn't do a lot except for like the nether and the portal travel and trying to get nether wart but i ended up getting more than nether wart anyway um thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in episode six